So this is 2XL from 1978 by Migo. He's basically a quiz-playing robot. He plays games with you, asks you a bunch of questions, and depending what button you push, will jump that the tape head will jump to the either the correct answer track or the wrong answer track. The thing was just ingenious. Uh, it's considered one of the most innovative toys, especially of its time. And I tell you what, this thing is really, really fun, no matter what age you are. So let's take a look at him a little bit deeper. Yeah, let's just right quick go over what he comes with. Of course, he comes in a box. Here's uh, two little cards that kind of go over top of the buttons for different games that it will do, play. Uh, you just get your regular instruction booklet, caution paper. You get this one. This one eight track comes with a general information and of course the power supply. So we're gonna plug him in and take a look at what he does. Okay, let's take a peek at what old 2XL does. Uh, first, we wanna turn him on. Then when you pop in the eight track, he should start up. Sometimes he doesn't. So you can hear him switching tracks. Thank you for turning me on. Let me introduce myself. I am 2XL, the smartest toy robot in the world. And if you don't believe me, just come a little closer, and I'll challenge your human brain with my electronic brain. Before we begin, I have three instructions for you to remember. Now, you can't see because of the light on the camera, but his eyes are blinking. The word now. The word now is your clue to choose an answer. Two, never push buttons or answer questions on your own. Only push buttons when I tell you to. Three, please follow all of my instructions. It is important. You will be happy to know that because this is my introductory program, I have two programs on the tape in my belly. The first program does not use the little booklet that came with this tape. The second program does. If you would like to hear the first program, push A. Or if you would prefer to hear the second program that uses the booklet, push B. Please push A or B now. Thank you. You have pushed button A, and I now know you want to hear the first program in my belly. I now have an instruction for you. Please push the question button now. I would now, as 2XL, like to make a presentation. <laughs> I now have question number one ready. Now remember, since this is only an introductory program, some of my questions will seem easy to you, while others seem hard. But do your best in either case. Question number one is about world record. This will be a true or false question, so please use the true or false buttons to answer it. The fattest man who ever lived weighed over 1,000 pounds. Answer true or false now. Have you ever considered donating your brain to science? You have answered true, and you are correct. You may be interested to know that a man named Robert Earl Hughes weighed 1,069 pounds. When he was six years old, he already weighed 203 pounds. As a matter of fact, when Mr. Hughes died, he was so heavy, he had to be buried in a piano case. And another thing that he does is, if you have any regular 8-tracks, Here's Christmas with Slim Whitman. He will play them.
probably get a copyright strike for playing that. And saving this for last, those of you who are interested in boxes. If you're not interested in boxes, you can end the video now. If you'd like to see the box, this is what it looks like. Nice big tear in it there at the top. No batteries necessary. That is one of the cool things I like about him, that he has a power supply. 